This video will help you get started in creating a book. With Tappable, your project is broken down into scenes, objects, and behaviors. The scenes hold your objects and are like pages in a book. Objects are individual items within the scene. This includes any text or illustrations. Each object can have its own behaviors. Behaviors are what make your scene and objects interactive and come to life. To get started, you need to import your images into Tappable. For more details on importing and image specifications, see the help documentation and videos on importing. One thing to keep in mind, you should also import your text for your books this way, as Tapple does not currently support fonts or rich text. Once you have all the necessary images into Tappable, you can start dragging them into position on your canvas. You can add basic interactions, like moving objects very easily. Let's start by making an object move when the reader touches it. First, select the object you want to move. Next, go to Behaviors to start adding interactions. Drag on the started touching behavior. Now drag on and move to point behavior, and drag it to the already added started touching. The move to point behavior will move the object to a selected point onto the canvas. You can choose a specific point by entering the location in the X, Y input fields, or do this visually. To do this visually, tap the object graphic in the behavior properties. Tap the object graphic. Now move the blue target to the desired location. Tap the check mark icon to accept the new position. Notice that the X and Y fields are automatically filled in. Now your object will move after you've touched it. Press play to try it out. The next thing you probably want is to make a new page in your interactive book and swipe the screen to turn the page. There are a few different ways we can add the swipe gesture. You can add the behavior to a specific object in your scene or add it to global behavior so it affects all the scenes in your book. Let's add it to the global behavior so you don't have to repeatedly add it to every page. Tap the button in the top left corner to open the creation menu. Then tap global behaviors at the bottom. The behaviors you add here will affect your entire project and execute when you load each scene. Drag a swipe left behavior. Now tap the behavior to open up the behavior properties. Notice a switch labeled swipe on anything. Set this to the on position. Now you can swipe on anything in your scene to execute the behavior instead of being restricted to swiping to a specific object. Next, add the load next scene behavior and connect it to the swipe behavior. If you want, you can also add a transition while it loads the next scene. For example, you can choose a page flip animation. Finally, add a new scene to your project. Open the creation menu, then tap add new scene to create a new scene. Since you added your swipe gesture to the global behavior section, any new scene you add will automatically be able to swipe to the next scene. So you can press play and notice that you can swipe right away. And that's it. Try experimenting with the different behaviors to add more interactions.